you guys welcome back to my channel so I'm gonna go ahead and just dive right on to this because it has been a little while since I have done a wig review um, a wig that I purchased that's already ready to go so we're gonna go ahead and get right into this, this is the Tatiana unit I bought it in a color one it is Empress lace wig lace front edge and then it's by Sensational. So this is the packaging that it comes in, just like this, the good old snap bag. Um, it's a color one. The style is Tatiana, and it's heat safe, 350 to 400 degrees. Um, and yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and take it out. I did buy this with my own money. It was $19.99, and I ordered it from sistawigs.com. It came in two days Being from Chicago to Georgia, so that's pretty good. But um, I'm going to go ahead and take this out. Uh, I bought this wig because I did want it for protective styling purposes and it does look like natural hair so if you're looking for some hair that emulates your own hair on a budget then this would be probably what you go to so I'm just going to show you what it looks like fresh out of the pack and then I'm going to style it into how I would wear it to make it look a little more natural so it's not like that fresh wig right out of the box look if you know what I'm saying. So this wig does have lace for, uh, at the front about mm, I'd say an inch of lace then it has three combs in the front and one right here at the back it also has adjustable straps um so the three clips in the front just for snug it's two here and then one in the very front um right there and then you have this one at the bottom so just showing you guys the texture i'm gonna put this really close so that you guys can see this is like marley hair texture um so the more that you finger detangle and put your fingers through it and work your magic however you want to then this hair will get bigger but if you do want this hair to get bigger, then I would suggest just taking your finger and then gently just thumbing through each little individual strand and allowing it to part naturally where it does. Then that way um, it does create a little bit of frizz, but not too much. And it separates and allows the hair to get a lot bigger. So then that way you can keep some of the definition um, from the twist or the individual strands and then you can have extra fluff and give you that extra volume so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on trim off this lace and then you guys are gonna get to see what it looks like actually on me okay so this is the difference between the sides this side is just fresh out of the pack which i mean honestly like you shouldn't have too much of a problem with this if you like the way this looks then go for it definitely leave it like this but i actually prefer this side better and i just took a wide tooth comb um that's the shedding that happened as I was combing through the hair. And then I took a wide tooth comb and then just raked through um, and fluffed out. I did leave some pieces that were still textured, like I said, to make it look more realistic and it's just not a frizz ball of hair. Then I also pulled out some of my edges um, so that it blends like naturally and seamlessly so that you don't have that perfectly sculpted hairline from when you cut the lace off the wig. Also, I do wanna say that there is no um, hairline parting or anything like that it's just free flowing um, so you don't get any parting space so that is why I pulled out some edges not only because of the hairline is like very super like Barbie doll uh, curved and cleaned up but also because there's not any parting space so if you pull out your edges then it just looks like it's growing right out of your scalp but I'm gonna go back in and fluff out this side. I also did take some scissors and shape this up because there were some pieces that were hanging a lot longer um, out of place of where they needed to be. So I just, to make sure that it's not all one length and then some pieces are coming down further than other pieces, I just went in and trimmed that out. So I'm gonna go back in with a wide tooth comb, the same one that I used before and fluff out this side to give you guys the final look. In the end, this is how much hair that I ended up trimming off. Just this little foot. It's honestly not that much. I just trimmed up the sides and brought it up a little bit because I honestly, I didn't like it that long. So um, it still has some length to it, but it's a little past my collarbone, like about two inches past my collarbone. And then I fluffed out the other side and I brought out a few more edges on this side. But yeah, this is the finished look. It just looks like a very big blowout. You can um, leave it how it is coming straight out of the package. I don't think anything's wrong with that. You can honestly probably like twist back a few pieces and then it just looks really cute like a wash and go that you just... Um... <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't know where I was going with that, but... Ugh. 
Or you can honestly just leave it the way it comes straight out of the package. Um, also in the packaging, I forgot to mention that it comes with a wig cap. So if you don't have one, then they just send you one. And it says that it's two pieces. So I think it comes with two wig caps in one pack. But um, it's a one size fits all and it's just in a jet black color. But this is the final look that I went for. I really like it. It's very... <sighs> You can tell that I'm feeling it. I'm just getting into it, but I'm getting into character. <laughs> oh my goodness. But I really do like this a lot. It looks like a blowout and I think it's great. You can have your hair braided up on under here and just have this going on. I love this actually. Like it looks so good. Just give you guys a texture shot. And I kept a lot of these pieces. So then you still have some curls going on and then you have like some fluff, but this is, this is awesome. So if you just want to change it up real quick and you want to change it up for a decent price, then <laughs> this is what I would recommend most definitely. I love, I love it. I adore it. I don't have any complaints at all. Um, it's great and it it's more realistic without the parting space i think that if you did add some parting space in here it would take away from it but overall i'm really happy um again i bought this from sisterwigs.com it was 19.99 it is the tatiana unit and i did order it in a natural one jet black color not a natural one that's not natural one b is natural <laughs> in a jet black color um, but that is all that I have for you guys. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. Um, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, like the video, give it a thumbs up. Tell your friends, share this video with your friends. Bring a friend next time so it can be a party. Um, but as always, thank you guys so much for watching my video and I will catch you guys next time.